All right, guys, in this lesson, it's time to finally build our first funnel. So let's go ahead and dive in. If you're on the main dashboard, you can just hit the little yellow plus new funnel button. Otherwise, you can just go up to the ClickFunnels tab and go to your funnels area and hit the little add new button here. So we'll go ahead and add new. Now there's two ways to build a funnel. You can actually use the cookbook builder process or you can use the classic funnel builder. Since this is probably your first funnel um, and you might want a little bit of guidance, I would recommend using the cookbook builder process. So let's go ahead and I'll show you how to do that. So you hit start cookbook. Now right here you can go ahead and select the funnel type that you want to build. So let's say that we are in e-commerce. So what it'll do is it'll find the e-commerce templates and you can decide, okay, do I want a video sales letter funnel, a storefront, lead magnet, squeeze page, daily deal, uh, sales letter, two-step, bridge funnel. If you don't know what any of these mean, don't worry. Um, right below this video, I'll link you to the Funnel Hackers Cookbook. It's a free download. You can also opt in to get the hard copy version so you always have it on you. Um, but basically what happens is Russell goes through and breaks down all the different things that make up these types of funnels. So he'll tell you what's included in a bridge funnel, what's included in a two-step tripwire funnel, and how you set those up. So if you're not sure what the, these mean, you'll, you'll learn those eventually. Um, but let's say we're doing e-commerce and we're going to do just a two-step tripwire funnel. So use a low ticket front-end product and then upsell them your other products. So let's hit select funnel. This is a really easy process, guys. Here's an example video from the Funnel Hackers cookbook process that Russell um, goes through and shows you what's included in a two-step trip off funnel. Talks about how many pages are in here. Of course, you can add more add more pages to, to your funnel. Um, this is just more of a, a guide through the process. You can download the funnel map too if you like. A little bit more here, information. And then down here, you'll see the different templates you can use. You'll see some free ones. And then you also see some from the funnel marketplace that people have built that are done for you that are like kind of proven to convert funnels. Some of them have different awards one for them. So you can definitely take a look at those too. But let's just say we want to do a free one and uh, let's go in and just choose one. So let's, let's choose this one right here. You'd select that. You can kind of see an example of, okay, this is pretty cool. Um, yep. Looks good to me. This is what I want my funnel to look like. At least the, the groundwork, right? The framework. And we'd hit get funnel. So watch what happens here, guys. It's pretty cool. Working on delivering your funnel to your ClickFunnels account. Sit tight. Boom. Look at this. You got your four funnel steps already created in the order that they should be. And all your templates are already loaded up into the correct page. How cool is that? And now that we've built our first funnel, Go ahead and proceed to the next lesson where I'm going to show you all the different things on your funnel dashboard, what they mean, what you can do, and how to start editing this stuff. See you in the next lesson.